Welcome to the University of Minnesota Libraries. When it comes to libraries, many people think of books, buildings, or maybe a sad computer lab. But we want you to know that the UMN Libraries offer great spaces, a huge amazing website, and lots of research help. You can try a bunch of what the library has to offer online at lib.umn.edu with your computer or phone. Try it now. Sign in with your UMN email and password. When it's time to do research, remember that although Google is a great place to start looking for information, the scholarly sources and journals that you will need for your classes may be hard to find on Google, or you'll be asked to pay for PDFs. On our website, lib.umn.edu, you can find and read online journals and academic books, magazines and newspapers like The Atlantic or The New York Times without the paywalls. Your tuition dollars pay to make sure you can get what you need for your classes, so don't ever pay for articles. You can watch documentaries and listen to streaming music from the comfort of your home or residence hall. Also, check the library website for your textbooks and course readings. We don't have everything, but we might have something you need. Research guides can help you to get started with research. Each guide will show you a list of databases. Databases are smaller, more subject-specific places to search for journal, magazines, and newspaper articles. Some databases also include data, maps, statistics, and historical sources. The research guide will also introduce you to the librarian who is the library expert for that area. We have a librarian for every department on campus. You can email them a quick question or set up an online consultation for in-depth help. It has been a crazy couple of years, but we know college still means taking notes, managing your time in new ways, and figuring out how to study effectively. Effective U has short videos and tips on note-taking, time management, effective study habits, and taking tests. You can explore them now. Hopefully you get the idea that our website, lib.umn.edu, is a great resource. When you're on campus, the library has great study spaces, ambiance, and more. The four largest libraries are Wilson Library on West Bank. The books on the shelf at Wilson are about social sciences and humanities, like history, business, psychology, education, and more. Walter, the science and engineering library, and the health science libraries are on East Bank. McGraw Library in St. Paul has collections about agriculture and design. You can find reservable study rooms, quiet spaces, collaborative spaces, Spaces with windows, spaces with plants, spaces with fun architectural details. We have big tables, small tables, and chairs. Chairs, chairs, so many chairs. We definitely have a spot for you. We also have unique spaces like our one button video production rooms and maker spaces. There's even a toaster. No, not that kind of toaster. The toaster is an innovation hub in the basement of Walter Library. Your U card is your library card and is helpful to bring along with you so you can use it to pay for printing and more. Remember that we're here to help. You can meet online with a peer research consultant, a tutor for library research. We also have free peer tutoring in over 200 different courses. You can also chat with a librarian 24 seven. Yes, chat with a librarian 24 hours a day, seven days a week with any questions you have. So let's recap. Why do students use the libraries and the website? Some need access to a computer or printer. Some want a place to study with friends or a quiet place to spread out and work on a project. Some just want a place to relax between classes, while others use our website to find sources, watch a documentary, or get help with questions about research assignments. Whether you visit us virtually on our website or safely in person, welcome to the University of Minnesota Libraries.